Many of you should be familiar with this. When a parallel beam of light were to be parallel to the principal axis, after passing through the converging lens due to bending of light refraction, it will come closer and converge to a point here, which is known as the focal point or principal focal point. And you should know that the distance between the focal point F here to the optical center, the center of the lens, that distance is known as the focal length of the lens. But what if the parallel beam of light is at an angle? For example, take a look at this or here. Okay, if the parallel beam of light hits the lens at the angle, it will still converge to a point over here and it's along this dotted line here. And this dotted line here is known as focal plane. If you realize the distance between here, the focal plane to the lens, the center of the lens, remains the same. So the focal length is still the same. That's how you identify. Okay, so another situation is what if the parallel beam of light hits other parts of the lens as such? Okay, likewise, it will still converge to a point along the focal plane. And this distance will still be the focal length of the lens. So take a look at the simulation again to get a clearer picture. So this will still be your focal length of this lens.